In the days to come, Jesus will soon speak. For as I speak now, men are wasting. And people say, oh, it's a waste. Even those that have said Lord to Jesus say, it is a waste. Those that have not said Lord to Jesus say, waste. But he will soon understand it. And when he understands it, he will speak. The first thing he will say is, why do you trouble this man? <laughs> oh. <laughs> why do you trouble him? He will not allow you to be troubled. Now you are buffeted with many troubles, financial. A time will come when he will relieve you from trouble and say, trouble not this man. For he has wrought a good work on me. Oh my God. Jesus will speak in the days to come and he will give a decree from henceforth let no man trouble you because you have borne in your body the marks of the sufferings for Jesus Christ trouble not this man for he has wrought a good work on me and my case, I'm, I'm talking to some people. Who, I am actually speak, speaking to a set of people. Wherever this gospel is preached in the whole world, this deed that this man has done, this deed that this woman has done, shall be told. For a memorial unto him. Trouble not this man. Trouble not this woman. Trouble not this boy. Trouble not this girl. Are you ready to waste? Because God is looking for people that will waste upon him. <laughs> In a moment of time, we want to say, Lord, I'm not ashamed of wasting. I'm not ashamed of having a name. I'm not ashamed of people troubling me because of my commitment to you. I have refused to change my mind. Emina Jose Sahi Kombe Lama Suka Patala Mayekoteli Trouble not this man Trouble not this woman For he has wrought a good work upon me Can you tell him? It's a prayer of commitment. It's a prayer of dedication. I am not ashamed to waste. I'm not ashamed. I will go on wasting. I'm not ashamed. Even when people misunderstand, I will go on waste. If the sons and daughters of Nigeria will waste before the altar of the Lord, the jealousy of the Lord will be aroused and he will stop the Assyrian. He will resist the Assyrian. So we waste. We waste on the altar. The clean creatures are being sacrificed. There is a sweet smell that is ascending into the heavens of God. This morning is a service of dedication. 
It's a service of the wasting men and women. We waste. For he will soon understand. We waste. He will soon understand. He will soon analyze and interpret the essence of our wasting. It is time for you to commit yourself afresh. Do not accept the discouragements around you. We wish so that we can anoint him beforehand. We pour out ourselves before the altar. So that we can anoint him. He must be anointed. He must be anointed. The alabaster box must be poured over. The box of spike knife must be poured on him. He must be anointed. He must be anointed. The Lord must be anointed. He must be anointed. He must be anointed with the fragrance that will come from your life. He must be anointed.
and reap the nations for you. Spend my life. Spend my life. And reap the nations for you. Spend to you. Spend my life. No. 
Mungu ya kandele na noja na Natana ina kuchini gini Ina kuchini gano kugia na boyane Wajia na noja nene Jene menano hie kogone Hia na nene hechu wa nene Jia mana ni jiliana Jesus name. This is a serious conference we are into. When the glory of God comes down, there is no minister. Everybody needs to be ministered to. Today we be a witness against you in the day of judgment. If for everything that God has shown you, revealed to you, spoken to you about, given you grace for, opened up to you, you still did not amount to what he has ordained for you today. Today we stand against you. In Jesus' mighty name. You can be seated for a moment. I want to honor and celebrate the men of God that is in the house. I don't know many of them. First of all, my father in the Lord, Apostle Aaron Mosai. And then, and then my brother, Theophilus Sunday. Amen. He's a man of God that knows Jesus. He's not just a he's not just an anointing. He knows Jesus and he wants to know Jesus. Tio, thank you, sir. Thank you. And then our pastor that is always here, Pastor Chukwemeka Ezuka. Let's welcome him. <laughs> then Venerable has always been with us in this conference. Venerable Prince Chukuma. Let's welcome him. And then Pastor John is here, Pastor Ebuka is here. I noticed that somebody, a senior minister, is also with us in the house. I've not, I've heard so much about him, but I've not met him physically. And thank God he's with us today in this morning session. He is the senior pastor and president of Kingdom Diplomat. 